Hey, all my fashionistas and fashionistas out there. It's your plus size fashionista. Mm -hmm. Yep. And this is going to be a review from Milani Cosmetics. So, if you guys want to stick around and stay tuned for my review from Milani Cosmetics, you got this on too. Stick around and stay tuned, fashionistas. Okay, okay. I am back on my fashion these and dolls. Like I said in the intro before, this is a review from Milani Cosmetics. And I would like to thank them so, so much. And I'm so sorry for this review being so long overdue. But I'm so, 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 so sorry. So, without further ado, let's get to the review. You guys know I love Milani Cosmetics. I've done tons of reviews on their items. And as well as being sponsored by them, I have purchased items from them as well. You guys can find their items at, I believe, Target, Walmart, Kmart, or any other um, stores that carry their items in between, but I know most definitely um, Walmart and Walgreens carry their okay, items. Okay, you guys. So, without further ado, let's go on and get into the review. Um, I'm going to be doing a review on their Shadow Eyes products. I was sent two of them. And if you guys do not know, their Shadow Eyes is an eyeshadow that's in a stick form. And you can put it on your eyes, your lash line, if you want to do... Um, put it all on your your lid if you don't you just want to put it on your waterline lash line you can do that and I will set two of them and this is the original packaging of both of them I want to keep them so I can show you guys and this one is in royal purple and I can swatch these for you guys and if you guys are not following me on Instagram you need to because before I do any review, I post different things and I do I post swatches and everything on my Instagram. I'm trying to make another blog because my last blog I lost the password to that one. So I'm trying to create a new blog as we speak. And um this turquoise one is called Aquatic Style. So I'm swatching aquatic style right here. And I'm swatching gray or purple right here. What I can say, this is this product is really creamy. It glides on like a dream. It's not cakey. Um, it's not pasty on. It's you really don't feel it on, like really. And the color payoff is phenomenal. This is aquatic style, and this is royal purple. And I really love this. Now it is made for usage by itself because it is an eyeshadow stick. However, you can do that if you want to. To each his own but how i normally do it is i will put it on first and use it as base and then i'll use a color that is you know the same color of that and i'll do it like that because i really don't feel comfortable putting it on by itself now you can like i said to each his own but i more so use them as bases to give more intensity and more depth to a look that I'm trying to achieve. And you guys know I will have their direct website, which is MilaniCosmetics.com, as well as I will have the direct link of Shell Eyes and the price. So you guys will know it should not be no more than seven bucks. Their products are really affordable. I have almost everything of theirs. I have eye eyeliners, um, concealers. Uh, lipsticks, uh, nail polishes. As a matter of fact, this is a nail polish I have on for Milani right now, and it is Pink Hottie, and I absolutely love it. I did a manicure and pedicure, I believe, two days ago, and I love it. Only thing I do not like is, and it's not the nail polish. It's nail polishes in general. When you're doing a manicure on your natural nails, it tends to chip. I do not know why, but it does. And I'm really upset because, you know, I love to get my nails done and all of that, you guys. And it just chips. Not only, it's just every nail polish and I hate that. But my toes are in tip-top condition. I will put a picture in this video how my toes are looking. Same color. I love, 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 love Milani. I can't stress it enough, you guys. So I want you to check them out. Enough of me rambling. Check them out. 
Yes, this is a sponsor review, but everything came to me wonderfully. Shit, good correspondence with them is wonderful. You guys know that you guys can check out my past reviews of theirs as well as I did hauls that I bought their stuff with my own money. So this review is not biased. I don't care if a company sends me something or not. You guys know I give it to you 100% honest. So with that being said, that's enough. This review, I love everything. So. Without further ado, I want y'all to do one thing for me. Stay fly, stay fashionable, flesh. Also, tell a friend to tell a friend to subscribe to my channel. Until next time, honey nieces, you guys know what to do. Take care. Bye, honey nieces. Oh, before I get out of here, I know I'm going to get questions on my look. Really simple. I'll do a face of the day, so I won't, you know, give it too much away. But my earrings are from JLC Women. I've done a review on them, so I will put the link in the fashion box below. And these are... Um, they're not the key knob, but they're knob earrings. I don't want to mess up the name. But yeah, you guys, my necklace is from Wet Seals. I got a long time ago. I want a vintage vibe. And this cuff is from Jazz Elise. So yeah, that's about it, you guys. So until next time, take care, honey, Bye, you guys.